Hey, it's your girl, Beat Thirsty Pretzel. Welcome back to Disney Princess Challenge. It's been a while since I said that. Um, if you watched season one, hopefully you did, um, either while I was actually playing it or during my little hiatus where I was doing the makeovers of the Disney princesses to look more modern. I'll actually put a little card up if you want to check those out. But um, yeah, if you watch season one, you know that we followed Snow White's part of the challenge. Now we are on to her heir, Ella, soon to be Cinderella. Um, and if you watched the beginning of the video, you'll know that some drama has gone down. <laughs> so um, I have our Ella here, fresh from the funeral of her father, the prince, Prince Florian, and she is now in the home, which she already was at the end of season one, she had run here and collapsed in the front lawn of this huge castle um, because she had a fight with her mom, Snow White. So she is now in the... I guess I was going to say custody, but I don't know if that's the right word. Um, but now her guardian, because her father married this lady, is Lady Tremaine. Um, she has a stepsister, Trisella, and another stepsister who, for some reason, is facing the wrong direction. What's up, girl? Um, so, yeah, we're going to get into this. Hopefully you're excited. I know I am. I've missed my Disney Princess Challenge. But before I get started, let me just go over the rules of the second generation with you guys. So the rules of this challenge says growing up with six siblings is hard, especially when no one else is taking care of the house, which we did do. We made sure she did all the chores. A dreamer from a young age, Cinderella often thought of having animal companions and finding her one true love. Optional, Cinderella goes to live with her father when she becomes a teenager, which she did. Her father has remarried an awful woman with two daughters of her own. Her father dies, leaving her alone with her horrible stepmother and stepsisters. This can be varied for your own personal storytelling. So we've done all that. Um, you saw it in the beginning in my little attempt at a machinima. Hopefully you enjoyed. So the rules of this are Cinderella begins when she becomes a teenager. She must have the neat trait. She does must have the loves animal trait. She does may have any aspiration you wish. Cinderella may not leave home lot while a teenager except for school. May only meet love interest at a party, but the party cannot be started by her. Must clean the house and cook every meal. Can only marry and move out after becoming a young adult must become a vet and run her own clinic, must max vet skill, must reach five stars in vet clinic, must have two pets at all times, may have any number of children, but the last female born is the next heir. Those are the rules. That's what I'm going to try to do. Let's get into it. Okay. Uh-oh. Loading's open. Oh, where the hell did they just go? Oh, they all went to school. Okay. So I'm going to have her listen to teacher. Um, I'm pretty sure Anastasia would make friends because she's friendly and Drisella is evil. So I feel like she would probably just uh, play games in class. So yeah, we're gonna, I'm gonna show you the house actually. Okay, so this is her dog. Oh, no, no, no. You're not supposed to be nice to the dog. I think actually I need to make sure you have a bad relationship with the dog. So we're gonna do that. Friendly disliked. There we go. So this is the dog Bruno, who actually her father Florian got her as a welcome gift to this beautiful house that I got off the gallery. And I will make sure to include, I'm going to show you in this mode. I'm going to make sure to include the description of the name of the builder of this house because they are freaking amazing. So I'll give you a tour of the house while this lady... Can you go inside? Um, is outside. So, tour of the house. This up here, this little tiny kind of open room <laughs> is Ella's room. And I'm actually going to assign. Oh, I can't because she's not here. This is her room. This tiny room that has nothing in it that you have to take this ladder to get to. Um, next, we have this room, which is 
I'm pretty sure it's Lady Tremaine's room. Yeah, this is Lady Tremaine's room on this floor. Um, which it's this room. She has a closet. There's like a little sitting area. There's a, I guess, a walk-in wardrobe type place. And she has a bathroom. Then if we go downstairs, we have... Um, this is Trisella's room. There wasn't a green swatch for this, but this is Trisella's room. This is Anastasia's room. Great. Okay, during art, Ella's class was instructed to create flower-themed cards for each other. After gathering glitter, colored pencils, construction paper, petals, and fuzzy pipe cleaners, Ella sat down, her creative juices flowing. The cards would be shared and opened with the rest of the class during the party later, so this had to be good. Two themes came to mind. Create hilarious or create heartfelt. I feel like she would do heartfelt, but that's probably wrong too. Okay, so basically Anastasia got embarrassed and I messed up Ellis too. Oh no. Okay, Drisella, I guess is gonna get hilarious. She's the only one who's gonna have a good love day. So that's great. Um, yeah, so this is Anastasia and um, Drisella's room. The first floor, oh, and then I can't forget the cat. This is Lucifer the cat, who is Lady Tremaine's cat. Ooh, Anastasia make Wolfgang at school. This is the dining room. This is the entrance sitting. I don't know what it's called. I guess it's just the entrance. And this is the kitchen that I have actually locked the door. I think I did. Oh yeah, okay. I locked the door for everyone except for Ella and Bruno. So... Yeah, the only person who can come in the kitchen is Ella and Bruno and I guess Lucifer. I don't really remember actually about the Lucifer part. But yeah, this is the house. There's also a basement, which I guess Ella's going to be the one using primarily because this is where the laundry's done. Um, there's some storage in here. And yeah, that's basically it. Yeah, um, I'm gonna play it a little weirdly because um, she has to become a vet and you can't become a vet. I was playing historically, their outfits are historical, but she can't really be a vet in historical times because the equipment doesn't match up. So it may turn into a, it's historically dressed, but modern vet kind of a situation if it gets too confusing i might switch them midway over into more modern um times if that makes sense but let me know in the comments if you guys agree with that Ooh, ella is angry she has her period that kind of sucks she needs some tampons or pads we got to get some of those for her when she comes home oh there's no computer still so that's why I need to make a decision about whether or not we're going to make this a modern type series, because if we are, then I guess I can get them a computer. She's going to get her tampons. They're all going to get them because I think they're all about to get their period if they don't. Ooh, she's flirty. A plus holiday. The fluttering love indigestion. It doesn't really matter. Okay. She had a good day at school be oh, because it's love day and I didn't ruin it for her out of everyone. <laughs> yes, they are home from school. Drizella is a C student, Anastasia is a C student, and of course Ella is an A student because Ella is awesome. Okay, can you come please put this in your inventory? Um, you're gonna go use the bathroom. Hopefully, I'm going to have you use your bathroom upstairs. Uh, yeah, come use this one, the fancy one. Um, you also need to use the bathroom. So you're going to come use... Do they share a bathroom? I think they share a bathroom. Um, so I guess you're going to use your mom's bathroom then. Which I don't think she would like, but that's fine. Come use your mom's bathroom. Oh, this is definitely going to be hard to film. Get this in her inventory. And then, Ella, you need to get this in your inventory. And you're going to come um, open this. Open. Unpack. And you're going to come use one of these. 
build a bowl like I was saying. Clean this up. Um, come make dinner. Serve dinner. Guess you're gonna serve... No, not fish tacos. Can you just cook... Um... Maybe pan-fried tilapia. She's not vegetarian or anything, so that's fine. Okay, you gotta stop showering. I'm taking a bath. We're gonna have the girls switch into... Oh, she's so angry. You're gonna switch into your normal day outfit. Just this one. You are gonna switch into your normal day outfit, which is the green one. There we go. And why don't you do your homework? The sisters don't really get along. They kind of do, but their relationship is not super good. What are you doing with Lucifer? Yeah, go hug Lucifer and then she's not going to do her homework. She's going to have to um, take a nap. What do you mean? Can you clean this up or not? Clean it up. Clean it up, girl. And then, can you please cook what I told you to? Which was... pan fried tilapia. Do you not have cooking level 3 or whatever you need to make that? Oh, you do. So she's going to be in charge of washing the dishes, cooking all the meals, cleaning the whole house. It's kind of what she's in charge of. Do we have a litter box for Lucifer? I just thought of that. Do we have one? I'm going to have to put one in here. So even though our poor little Ella just came back from the funeral of her father and had her first day of school in her new house. Where are you going? Come make this. She's going to have to... Okay, go here and make this, please. She's still going to have to make dinner for everyone. Why can you not do this? Make the food. I just clean it up then. Serve dinner. Pan fried tilapia. Just do it that way. Can you do your homework now? No, I feel like she's not gonna do her homework, so. Did you finish? Perfect. So now, nope. You don't get to eat it. Put it down. We are going to put it out in the dining room over here and you get to call everyone to meal but then you don't get to eat it you get to eat this one nope stop grabbing a serving put it down you don't get to eat with the fam unfortunately it's not something you get to do okay you stop you're gonna come eat Ooh, I'm surprised she let her sit here. Okay, well. And then when she's done eating... No, no, no. You don't get to eat there. Take your food. Put in inventory. And you have to sit here and eat it. Where are you going? No, you don't wash anything. How do I get them not to wash things? But just put it down. Can you do your homework or not? I want her to talk to her sister and be kind of rude. You don't get to... Oh yeah, chat with Drusilla. That's what we... Okay, she's in here sitting. You're gonna eat your garden salad. Okay, so you need to do your homework. And then you're gonna go to sleep. You are still very tense, so I know. I guess you're not doing your homework? Ooh, she's kind of a... I think she's telling her, like... Belindy. What a bad day she had at school. She's gonna come clean. Put this in the fridge. That's not the fridge. That's a cabinet. And then she needs to do laundry. So we're gonna have to... Do laundry. Add to washing machine. I don't know how much laundry there is, but... 
Uh oh. Oh, she's being nice to her. I'm surprised. Well, she does like her daughters better, obviously, than she likes Ella, but... When Ella's done doing the laundry... Oh, I forgot her mom gave her this. Okay, we're gonna... We can't add it to our wardrobe. Why can't we add it to our wardrobe? But who am I? I'm not sure what I want to be when I grow up. Oh, well, there's only one answer, so... That's nice. What the hell? Okay. Ooh, that wasn't good. Whatever that was, uh, was not good. Why did you change back into this? All right. Well, come wash the laundry. It's We're gonna have you change into what I'm gonna call your Cinderella outfit before you go to school tomorrow, and then you're gonna eat this salad. Are they fighting? over the food lucifer and bruno are fighting like they do in the cartoon and i love that oh finally she's gonna sit here and eat by herself like i was trying to get her to do lady anne says you should wear some concealer or foundation i would if my skin was like yours oh <gasps> savage so i think in general Elle is not having a good <laughs> Elle is not having a good time so have her call Allegra. She didn't do anything good for Love Day. I don't think any of them did, to be honest. Homework complete. Good job, Anastasia. So she's going to go to bed, hopefully. And you need to go to bed. She's reading, but she won't do her homework. Okay, do your homework, please. And then you're gonna go to bed. What? Alright, nope. What are you doing? Don't ask her for advice. Come refill this. She's so tense and upset. Um, Are you gonna do your homework? Yeah, okay. She's coming back to do her homework. We're gonna have Elle put the fire out. She has to wait till the laundry's done before she can go to bed. She can't do her homework now because she's tense. Did she do her homework? No. She's an A student though. Okay, laundry's done. So we're gonna unload, add it to the dryer. That's what I'm saying. I feel like I could potentially make this, even though it seems like it's historical, I could make this um, be more modern because I mean there are washing machines and a microwave but let me know what you guys would like me to do okay we're going to dry the laundry uh oh she doesn't feel good dry the laundry perfect and then you're gonna go all the way upstairs and go to sleep and is Ella upstairs yet oh she is she finally got upstairs to her very dark, very open bedroom. <laughs> She's gonna go to bed. She didn't do her homework, but maybe she can do it when she wakes up. Yeah, the only things I have up here for her are a violin. And that's it. Bruno can't even come up here because you can only get up here with a ladder. So that's fun. But I'm actually gonna end the episode here with just having her first day of school. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. You're looking forward to where this story is gonna go. We're gonna try to get Ella started on the pet vet kinda situation. So that will hopefully happen. Um, and we may be seeing some familiar faces soon. So don't forget to like the video, leave me a comment, let me know what you think. Subscribe if you haven't already and follow me over on Twitch. Bye pretzels.